Hey everybody! Ho 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 ho! Friday night with Santa and it could be a doozy. I gotta talk about something that Drew told, told me to talk about over on his channel Rage Fit. And also I was on Devin's channel on and I told him I gotta tell you about the USPS. They fucked with me yesterday. Oh, they messed up with me yesterday. Sorry about that. But I got my eggnog and I got the crown 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 royal. So uh, could be an interesting night. <laughs> Hi everybody. Okay, I'm uh, going to tell you two stories here. First story Drew asked me to tell you about, and that was uh, about my first kiss. I was five years old, and her name was Lourdes Scuderi. She was my next door neighbor, and we both went to kindergarten, but I went to a different kindergarten than she did. I went to the kindergarten at Flagler Street Baptist Church, and she went to the kindergarten at St. Michael's Catholic Church. But we were the same age. I was a month older than her. And anyways, we used to, you know, we used to play around, and, you know, we play like house stuff and all. And one day she says, I, I want to have a kiss like Mommy gets. And I... Gave her a kiss right on the lips, not on the cheek, on the lips. No tongue. You dirty-minded guys out there, no tongue. We were five years old. We didn't know about tongue. If you know about tongue at five years old, and there are a couple of guys on YouTube that I follow. I have a suspicions they probably knew about tongue at five years old. You guys, Santa knows. Santa knows who you are. You better be good. All right. Well, anyways, five years old, and that was my, uh, uh, you know, uh, first kiss. I'm a little bit, I got to have another booster shot. Uh. Fuck the macros this weekend. Who gives a shit? It's fucking Christmas. It's Christmas. Sorry about that. Oops. Shouldn't be. Well, cheers, everybody. Okay. I'm with my other story, and I'm going to make it kind of quick because i get under, got to get in under five minutes, and i probably got two minutes left. USPS yesterday screwed me over to the tune of $76.10. I was uh, mailing a, a fairly heavy box and it had to be secured so it was worth a lot of money and so the shipping cost seventy six dollars and ten cents I sold it on eBay and uh, the uh, lady that I was talking to on the phone I waited over an hour to talk to a lady at, U at USPS I waited I talked to her I was having trouble with the website uh, because it says you have an international address. And I live in Miami. I mean, yes, there are some people that think Miami is not part of the USA, but that's a whole political thing I don't want to get into in, on my channel. But, um, you know, there, there are people that feel that way. Anyways, I digress. Um, this lady had me press the button. She said, oh, everything's fine. Everything's okay. I hit the button. I buy my label. I print it out. And lo and behold, she says, oh, wait a minute. We can't schedule a pickup. I said, well, why not? I just spent $76. The least you people could do is come and pick this up. It weighs a lot of, it weighs 56 pounds. I don't want to carry it to the post office. And I can't, it's too big to put in the mailbox. So you got to come pick it up. She was like, uh, no, they can't. I'm like, you told me everything was okay. 
and I just spent $76.10 on postage. And she says, well, I'm sorry. I said, you're sorry, that's it? I'm sorry? I asked you before I pushed the button, I clicked the button, is everything gonna be okay? The United States Postal Service strikes Effin again. Now I have to wait up to 14 days to get my money back and I still had to go to another carrier and buy the postage. Sometimes I hate the world, but I know that God's in charge and everything will be okay. That's my Vlogmas for tonight. I don't know. It wasn't a good one, but hell's bells. I'm going to enjoy the rest of the night with this and this stuff. I may survive. I may not. Really serious, guys. I'm not going to get totally what lambasted, but I'm starting to feel no pain. I'm down $76. That's some pain. This is drowning it. Good night, y'all. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Nobody's going to watch this. I know nobody will watch. This will probably have like 20 views. And it's probably one of my funnier videos. Oh. Excuse